guys, Dr. Squish here. Since it is summertime for most people all around the world, I am going to be making some beach time slime. I am going to be starting with some clear PVA glue. Clear Elmer should work. My favorite activator. You use your favorite activator. I'm going to be putting a little bit of sky blue coloring in. Got my mixing spatula. I'm even going to be adding in some awesome seashells. Some, whoa, throwing the glitter around, some glitter, some water. And when it's all over with, we are gonna be adding some super cool stretchy sea creatures, kinetic sand, beach stuff. It's gonna be crazy, I'm so excited. Stick around to see the end product. Start off by putting in my glue. Gonna add water. Now I want this to be a really, really oozy slime, so I'm going to add a lot of water. Just mix that together. You wanna make sure the glue and the water is good and mixed. I'm gonna put a little bit of the sky blue coloring gel in there. Now that is a gorgeous blue color and all those little bits and pieces are gonna get mixed in later so I don't wanna add any more blue coloring quite yet. I'm gonna add in this super pretty glitter. This is a good time to add your glitters. Now this is going to be some gorgeous beach water. Oh my goodness, look how sparkly it is. Can you guys see how pretty it is already? Now I'm gonna add the activator. I wanna add a little at a time. You add your favorite activator, I'll add mine. Just start with a little. You can add more later if you need it, but you can't take the activator out. And just start stirring. You will see it automatically it starts making slime right away. But you gotta mix it to get all that water mixed into this mixture. There's a lot of mixing going on here. I'm going a little more slowly than I usually would because I'm trying to keep as few bubbles out of it as possible. That means I'm gonna have to mix for a much longer time, but I don't want too many bubbles in it. We want this slime to be clear if possible. Three days later. Well, it hasn't been exactly three days, but the timer on my camera says I have been mixing this for a solid 10 minutes, no joke. I have been mixing this up with my spatula and then I got in there with my hands for 10 whole minutes. But you see what a beautiful slime it made? I wanted to mix it up that long because I didn't want to have too many air bubbles. I'm still gonna let it settle so the air bubbles can settle out of there but I wanted a nice, clear, oozy slime. And holy cow, look how oozy and stretchy it is because of all that awesome water that I put in and got soaked up in there. Sometimes people get confused, they're like, you put too much water, Dr. Squish. No, I didn't, folks. It is a beautiful slime. This is oozy, this is stretchy, this is exactly what I wanted it to be. I like my slime to be like super oozy, super stretchy. So I am gonna let this sit in the bowl for a couple of hours so that all those air bubbles can rise to the top and I can just have my super clear, beautiful slime. Then we'll get to making our beach scene. Oh yeah. All right, you guys, I have let my slime sit for a little while. You see how all these bubbles came to the top? All those bubbles were in the slime and now they've come to the top so it is just kind of a lot more clear, which is what I want. So we are gonna do two things with this beautiful blue slime. I am going to make an adorable beach scene with these adorable little miniature sea creatures and some palm trees and some kinetic sand. And I am also going to be making some crunchy type slime with these super de duper cute seashells that I found. Aren't they adorable? They're so cute little seashells. So that's what we're gonna do. So first things first, I'm gonna divide this slime just about right in half. We'll take about that much. That looks good. This turned out to be the prettiest blue slime. Oh, it's so oozy. It's so stretchy. And it is so clear and glittery. Isn't it pretty? I love this slime already. I found these for a dollar at the 100 yen shop. 100 yen is about a dollar. I'm gonna put some of these smaller shells in here and it's gonna be like an adorable crunchy slime. All right, I'm gonna fold these adorable seashells into my slime. And it's gonna make some super cool crunchy beach time slime. How summery and fun. Oh, you guys, look how cute it is. It is so adorable. This super stretchy, oozy slime filled with these seashells. 
What could be cooler? These little seashells were a steal at only a dollar for a whole bag, and I didn't even use half the bag. They're so cute. I love this. What do you think, guys? Ooh, so beachy. It is super beachy. I love it. This is the coolest summer slime ever. Oh, we got a hammerhead coming. Watch out, everybody. Shark in the slime. Oh, it is so cool. I love this stuff. I'm so happy with the way this is turning out. I bought these guys out of a capsule toy machine to cut up on one of my shows, but I thought they would probably be pretty happy to see some ocean slime. They're super squishy and stretchy. And I am so happy that they got to play in the slime. I am going to put this stuff over to the side because we're going to make a beach scene in the slime. Alright, I am going to put this awesome beach slime right there for just a minute because we are going to get to making our beach scene. Okay, first things first, I'm going to put in kinetic sand. This is just kinetic sand from the Daiso 100 yen shop. It's magical sand. This is like their dollar store version of kinetic sand. We can get some very cool stuff for a dollar. I love kinetic sand. Who else loves kinetic sand? It's so satisfying to play with. But we are going to build up a little shoreline over here. I am just shaping out a super cool shoreline here. I'm gonna try and make it look like the beach. Who is going to the beach this summer? I wanna hear what you guys are gonna be doing this summer. Let Dr. Squish know down in the comments what you're doing this summer. Are you gonna go to the beach? Are you gonna go to the pool? Now I am going to put in our super cool blue slime that I left out. Here we go, guys. Oh my gosh, it looks so pretty. Stick a little palm tree right here. Put some of this sand over it. Put some of these shells on the beach that we found here. Maybe another palm tree like back here. This will be cute. A couple more seashells just around the beach. It is already so super stinking cute. I am gonna put these little guys. I got these from the dollar store also. Aren't they adorable? <gasps> they look just like my big guys. I'm gonna set him like out here in the deep ocean. Let me cover him up a little bit. He's like just come out of doing a jump, diving back in the water. My hammerhead up here close to the shore. Watch out everybody. Super cool a dolphin. Oh my goodness, you guys, this turned out so cute. This little beach scene is adorable. My hammerhead has sunk. Watch out, everybody, there's a shark in the water. It is so cute. Make sure you leave me a comment to let me know what you think about this summertime beach slime. Which was your favorite? The super cute beachy scene that I made with this adorable slime? Or the super cool crunchy seashell slime? It is so awesome. With your squishy sharks and whales. So much fun stuff on today's show. I think I should cut these guys up on a different show. What do you think? Everybody leave me a comment and tell me what you thought. You can tap on Dr. Squish's logo right over there. That way you'll never miss a squishy video right when it comes out. You can tap right over here to see a video you may have never seen before. And I will see you on my next show. Bye bye, squishy fans.